Hey, Maddie, a uh, bit of a two-part question. First is, how do you describe a night like this? And then second, in a semi-serious manner, what are you thinking when you're doing deeks and you're trying to do passes between the legs and the most crucial of moments? Because it's just, that's not something 19-year-olds do in, in, in overtime. So what was kind of the thought process there? Yeah, I mean, um, you know, first of all, it was a really fun night. And, um, you know, getting the win was awesome. Having family here was great. Um, you know, through the leg stuff, uh, you know, I think there was a couple of seconds left on the clock, you know, I've uh, done it before and, you know, gave it, just gave it a go. Um, you know, it didn't work out, so it doesn't look so good when it doesn't work out. But, um, yeah, no, I mean, uh, that was that was a play that I have done before and, you know, I had in my head that, you know, it was a good try and, um, yeah. Curtis. Maddie, congrats on your first goal. Can you kind of talk us through it when you see it come off the post there and leak out in front of the net and as you're seeing crashing it and your kind of emotions afterwards seeing it go in the back? Yeah, it was it was awesome. Um, you know, Donner kind of gave me the nod and said, I'm shooting this one. And I was like, all right, let's do it. So, um, you know, we won the draw back and someone had a nice tip and I was just crashing the net and it popped out to me. So, um, <laughs> you know, kind of lucky lucky goal for me and – um, you know, you don't get don't get many of those where they're just popping out and sitting in the crease and you just get to bat them in. So, um, you know, it, it was a great feeling. I just kind of jumped into Canada's arms after that. So it was great. Darren. Hey, Maddie, congratulations. I uh, wanted to hear what your first impressions were of uh, playing in Client Pledge Arena. Um, have you ever gotten an ovation like that in your career? And uh, finally, how do you think you did on your first career fish toss? <laughs> yeah, I'm, no, definitely not, not nothing, no standing o like that. Um, it was it was pretty amazing. I couldn't help but smile when I was when I um, you know got called. When I, first when I was skating around for um, you know when they were calling names of who's starting and they called my name and they they went nuts and uh, then after the goal it was it was electric. So um, you know both of those times I just couldn't couldn't stop smiling. So it was it was pretty great. Um, on terms of the of the toss, I I thought I did a pretty good job. Uh, I was I nah, I was aiming for a little a little kid. I think I th I overthrew it a little bit, but um, I didn't really see if he got. It. I hope he did. Ryan, Maddie, you've had big moments before, with, whether it be with the NCAA's, the Olympics. But when you look at what you've done through two games, I mean, how do you sort of balance the satisfaction of what you've done, but also the temperament of it's just two games. You don't want to get too far ahead of yourself, even though it's been a promising start. Yeah. I mean, um, you know, it's been a good start. Like you said, pretty good. Um, you know, there's, there's always better. So uh, I think, you know, it's been, it's been pretty good, like you said, and, but there's, there's a lot more work to do. And, um, you know, you want to build a team that's going to be really good, especially especially next year. You know, I know we're out of playoffs, but it's it's good to get to some momentum as the as the uh, years years getting over, and especially going into next year because um, you know your your goal is not to do too good; it's to do really well and make sure your team, especially, is uh, you know winning games. And if if you can help your team do that, you're doing well. So um, yeah, it's just been two games, like you said exactly, and uh, we got a lot more work to do. Curtis, you can go ahead and wrap it up. Yeah, Maddie, what did it mean to you when when Dave's throwing you out there early in overtime and calling on you to go into the shootout and being a part of that? You mentioned it's just your second game that you've already seemed to have established some level of trust to get the call in those sort of situations. Yeah, yeah. I mean, um, you know, it's it's exciting, and uh, you know, I've 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 found myself to you know really um, feel comfortable in those moments. Just. Well, I don't, I don't know, really know what it is, but over the years, I've, I've felt really comfortable, you know, when, when the game's on the line or um, overtime, things like that. So, um, you know, I was, I was super ecstatic to get the call and be able to go out there, play with, play with Jordan out there, and um, you know, it was a lot of fun. I think, uh, you know, hopefully we'll, we'll put one in the back of the net next time before, before we get to a shootout. But Donnie did a great job in, in groups, but you know, putting it home for us. So. Um, you know, and I wish I could have got that shootout back, um, but you know we got the win, so that's all that matters. Alrighty, all set, Maddie. Thank you. Thank you.